Are you wanting to hook up your electronic choke with a relay? I recently installed a new carburetor and now I need to finish hooking up the electronic choke. To do that, I'm gonna use a standard automotive relay. Standard relay like this is, is perfect for what we need to do. Uh, you guys may have seen this type of relay before. These are standard uh, terminals here and you can buy just the relay itself and put the spade terminals on there, but I like having this harness. It just makes it a little bit easier and it's a little bit cleaner setup. And I found a drawing online that basically lines this out for us. And then what I did is I ended up coloring, you know, adding the color of the wires to which ones we need to do here based off of this harness. Now this one I have may not match the same wires if you were to get a similar harness, but for what I'm using, these are the wires that I need to use. I don't need to use the blue one, but I need the red, the black, the yellow, and the white one to finish this out. So the way this is set up in this drawing, this is, you know, it's more or less the same thing. We're gonna wanna use this terminal right here and we're gonna to wanna to use this terminal on this side. And when we turn the key on the car, this terminal becomes active. Don't forget to put a fuse in line here. All right guys, that's it. That's how you put a relay in to actuate the electronic choke on your carburetor. 